straight. Here we go back. This is the moment. Tonight is the night. We'll fight till it's over. So we put our hands. Hello, what is going on, chaps? Coco Pops here. Welcome back to the channel for more Black Ops 4 Zombies content. We're on the map, Blood of the Dead. We're going to be showing you the unlimited specialist glitch after the 1.12 patch, with the one where you can hold your weapons. That one's still working as of now. The other method has been patched, and I'm going to show you this in the video just so you don't waste any time. It's the one where you have to hold a monkey bomb or a claimer to stick the specialist in your hand. Now, what you had to do is obviously put your second weapon inside the pack a punch machine. You also had to have the Blundergat. You could either do it with claymores or monkey bombs. You had to build the acid gap box on one of the tables, place your blunder gap inside the acid gap box, and what you had to do was pull out your specialist. When your specialist meter bar was running all the way down, once it was just about gone, you had to hold a monkey bomb or a claymore just until your specialist meter bar ran out. You could cancel that off and you have your specialist stuck. And now that does not work. What it does right here is it just pulls out to your hands instantly after you cancel off the monkey bomb or the claimer like I'm going to show you right now. Hold on the monkey bomb and as you can see, once I cancel this off it's automatically going to pull up my fist and the specialist is no longer going to stick. Now like I said I'm going to show you the other method which still works as of now where you could hold the weapons and stuff. It still involves the same method as of what I just showed you there. But this time you have to fill up your specialist to the end of stage 1 or the end of stage 2, so next time you pull out your specialist and start killing zombies with it, it's going to automatically rank up to the next stage. So that's what you want to do is put your second weapon inside the pack of punch. Same steps as before, like I said, put your blunder gat inside the acid gat box. You want to pull out your Ragnaroks and kill these zombies so your Ragnaroks fill up to the next again stage. If you're trying to do this when it's already on stage 3, it's not going to work. It only works when your Ragnaroks are switching from stage 1 to 2 or 2 to 3. Now what we're going to do is slow it down right here, you have to time this properly, watch the green meter bar, it's just about completely disappeared on the Ragnarok, so I'm going to pull out a monkey bomb, as soon as my hand touches the hat of the monkey bomb, I'm going to press triangle to cancel that off, and if you're timed it correct, you should see your Ragnarok slightly and it'll cancel off and you have your fist. Now every time you run and jump in towards the zombies, you're going to have the effect of the DG5 Ragnarok, so just do not pull out your Ragnarok or it will cancel off the glitch. You can go down, pick up weapons, do pretty much anything you want apart from pulling out your Ragnaroks. But apart from that, it has been Coco Pops. Drop a comment, subscribe if you new, if you thought the video was helpful. I'm pretty sure I have an idea for classified unlimited, I'll let you know. And catch the next one, enjoy. Bye bye.